The long-awaited day for Latter-day Saints in Orm has arrived. The church's new temple is about to open its doors to the public for the very first time. Today, new specialist Dan Rascone got one of the first looks inside. Dan? Yeah, very exciting time here in Orem for Latter-day Saints as the Orem Temple is about to open its doors to the public for the very first time. It was announced back in 2019, and today we got our first look inside. Absolute excitement. Overjoyed. The very first look inside the brand new Orem, Utah Temple of the Church of Jesus Christ to Latter-day Saints, the sixth temple in Utah County and 28th in Utah, filled with exquisite artwork, furnishings, stained glass, and details. But for Latter-day Saints, it's what happens inside the temple that really matters. One of the things that we learn there is that we should love God and we should love our, our neighbors. So as we leave the temple, we practice that love towards everyone. The 70,000 square foot temple sitting on nearly 16 acres is a sight you can't miss. Right off the freeway and right across the street, from UVU. It's a fantastic location. It's it's actually like impossible to miss. Zach Whitlock is a student body president at UVU. We're studying and we leave and we get a we get to look at it all day. Oh, it's so exciting to have a temple so close in our hometown. For the Lewis family who live in Orem, this is a long awaited day. Chad grew up in this area, went to BYU, and played in the NFL. But all that is nothing compared to what this temple means to him and his family. Orem is Family City USA, and here we have a temple that uh, seals families together for eternity, forever, forever. It was July of last year when someone set part of the temple on fire while under construction. It was a devastating sight, but today you would never know. It has come to life, and it is so beautiful. Every part of it, the, the artwork in there is, is all reflective of the Savior in this beautiful world. The public open house starts this Friday and it goes for seven weeks and then the temple will be dedicated. This is one of six temples now in Utah County and one of 28 in all of Utah. In order to get tickets, they're free, but go to our website, ksltv.com for a link. In Orem, I'm Dan Rascone for KSL 5 News.